Peace and blessings again. Okay, so here you go. Step number one into your application process. So now you're here on the application and you found it at, if you haven't gotten there, it's at www.uchunlimited.com www.uchunlimited.com. You may be seeing this video on the application or on Facebook or on YouTube, okay? So now on your first step of completing the application, you understand your, your membership fees are $70 for a family. If you have students who are kindergarten to fifth grade, you understand that if you have children who are particularly sixth grade to 12th grade, that is a membership fee per family of $140. And if you have students from kindergarten to 12th grade, bless your heart, I have the same. <laughs> but that membership is also $140 for the year for your family, not per student. If those fees are too much um, right off the bat, you do have an option for month to month payment of $13 for six months, if it would otherwise be $70, or $13 for 12 months, if it would otherwise be $140, okay? Very reasonable uh, to make that possible as you start your homeschooling journey. Now, each part of the application process on the application, I will have a video that walks you through everything you need to know so that it can be clearly understandable. And then plus, some people are not well uh, with reading, you know, and I, I just understand stood this from a few parents who may have some dyslexia or reading. So. Um, some reading issues or what have you, but these videos are to help you go through the process, okay? So as you complete your application, the first part is all your pertinent information. Make sure you give me an actual address, not a PO box. I need a physical address, an actual phone number that you would either like to be text on. If you don't want texting, you have an opportunity to say no text, but I do a lot of my contact through texting. It's just a quick way to say, hello, how are you doing? How's things going? Just checking in with you, okay? And then also you need to know that on this application, as you complete your membership, uh, every year, July 31st, uh, your membership will expire. So you will need to register before July 31st so that you can be prepared to continue legally homeschooling throughout the year. And then the last thing I, make, make, I will make mention to you is that you do not have to keep your schooling schedule along with the public school. So as a homeschooler under option three, you have the freedom to choose when you're gonna start your school year. You just have to complete 180 days in your schooling year, okay? But you don't have to start when public schools start. You don't have to end when public schools ends, okay? You can create your schedule. You can school on Monday, Tuesday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. You can school Monday, Tuesday, Thursday, Friday, uh, I, I, you know, you get it. You can choose whatever days you want. And then your timing, you get to choose. So that could be uh, in the mornings, it could be in the evenings, it could be a little bit in the mornings and a little bit in the evenings. You get to choose, but you don't have to be incongruent with the public school, okay? So as you complete the application, I'll be right there with you, helping you understand step by step what you need to know, okay? Any questions, always reach out to me uh, by text 864-300-2236 by email uchu third option at gmail.com or you can set up a time to actually get with me on the phone and uh, you can do that on my virtual calendar um, on Calendly that information will be here on the application okay all right go to the next step and I'll be there to help you along the way peace